We ex state officials laid out recommendations to make it easier to get from Toledo to Columbus, but the price tag is hefty. 13 Action News reporter Josh Krupp is live to explain why Ohio might have to raise the gas tax to fund that project and others across the state. Josh. And Tina, the state is proposing a series of fixes to US 23 just north of Columbus, a 23 mile stretch of highway that features 23 stoplights and already exceeds the road's initial capacity. The overall project could take up to a decade to finish and cost nearly $2 billion. But ODOT has already said it's going to see increased funding gaps in the coming years. One way to fix that, raise the gas tax. The last time that happened was in 2019 in Ohio. Back then, Governor Mike DeWine called for an 18 cent increase to help ODOT keep up with maintenance and construction needs. But the legislature only raised it by 10 and a half cents to 38.5 cents per gallon where it stands today. DeWine said at the time that increase would work just in the short term. Five years later, he now says future lawmakers and the next governor will have to make tough decisions about the gas tax to pay for major projects like the US 23 fix. This is not the only part of the state of Ohio, so Decisions have to be made about how how you can grow the pot. They have to be made about how you spend that pot, and how you divide it up. So. And Tina, there's also a concern about an increase in electric vehicles that could lead to a decline in gas tax revenues. An ODOT study last year recommended increasing registration fees for EVs to offset those declines. Tina, back to you.